For me, there's a bar in my head. And that bar is, I want every kid in our school district, regardless of their race, creed, gender, identification. I think it's important that they have the same opportunities that any other student in the school district. And that bar for me is my own students and my own children. And I think my job is to ensure that our students have what they need, regardless of who they are, what they look like, and to know that more of our kids are in the game. And then when I say in the game, in the game for success. Many of those kids are first time high school graduates that have placed themselves in a place where generationally now, they're setting a bar for their families, much like the bar that I've set for my families, much, much like the bar that has been set for many of our staff members and their families as well. And as we think about our portfolio of offerings, it's about ensuring that pathways are there. And if that pathway is in place for them, then success and generational opportunities will be there even further. And to even think about that and let that sit in for a second, to know that because a child has seen success in your school system, that now that that child's children and grandchildren will now have an opportunity and expectation that education is key. I will never be satisfied. And I don't think this school system, even beyond my leadership, will ever be satisfied. It's a mentality. Not only will we always continue to work to ensure that every one of our kids has an opportunity and work towards that 100% graduation rate, there's always more work to do, uh, always more pathways that we can improve or provide and build on. My expectation over the course of time, with the work that we're doing, I clearly expect for our graduation rate to increase. So that makes me feel good to see the progression uh, that's happening throughout the school district and the number of kids that have a pathway.